Retail therapy is the best therapy. Don't let nobody tell you any different. Hey besties, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jada Simone and you're watching Jada's channel. I don't love just anyone. I am not just anyone. I rock heels, I rock Jordans. And I wear wigs and rock my natural. Can you believe it says I'm pretty but with dark skin? Okay besties, so as y'all know, the Sephora sale is quickly approaching us if i'm not mistaken by the time today's video is posted i think the sephora sale might be tomorrow tomorrow or the next day or the next day it's it's this week it's coming up if i'm not mistaken it is from april 14th to april 24th if not i'll put like the correct dates here but if you are a girl who wants to get into makeup fragrance skincare all things that i love this video is definitely the one for you i will be talking about everything that i recommend buying for the sephora sale you know i don't recommend breaking the bank and breaking your pockets because i'm not doing that but you know just to give you guys an idea of some of the things that i will be buying and some of the things that i feel like you guys should be buying if you guys are interested in the things i like if you want to get into fragrance and you haven't yet this sale is perfect because if you are a rouge member you get 20 percent off i am a rouge member don't ask me how much money i spend this for it is ridiculous they have like the different tiers i might try to post it somewhere on the screen but a sale is a sale we love a good sale around here and if you are an og you know we hate paying full price on this channel so if you guys would like to know what i suggest getting during this upcoming sephora sale just keep on watching all right so let's talk about makeup first since i really haven't been too too much into makeup lately i really do want to go makeup shopping but your girl barely wears a full face i only put on makeup to come talk to y'all on youtube but <laughs> I do have some things in my cart or like in my wish list that I would like to get and I do have some recommendations for y'all so first things first is the Fenty Butter Gloss in the shade Ice. I currently have it I think it's in my bathroom I really don't feel like going to get it but it is just a nice clear gloss not too sticky it is literally perfect I have it on my lips now and when I tell you it really lasts like it probably lasts for a few hours it feels so good and cooling on the lips and if you are like a lip balm Carmex Blistex girl you will definitely like this so I definitely do recommend getting it it does retail for $26 but like I said with the sale there will be some coins off so definitely a great time to purchase any 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 fancy beauty products next thing on my list is the makeup by mario new foundation that just came out a few months ago if you guys watched one of my vlogs from like a few months back i did go into sephora and actually try out the foundation and i found my shade but i never actually purchased it i just got a sample but i really do like the foundation it's such a beautiful match and it definitely is long lasting and full coverage so i feel like Mm, if I'm feeling like it, I might pick it up during the sale. It does retail for $42 original price. Alright, so next let's talk about my favorite thing in the whole wide world, fragrance. So if you are not living under a rock, then you know that Kayali just dropped a new fragrance. It is called Yum Pistachio Gelato and I'm dying to get my hands on it. I really need to be on somebody's PR list. I don't understand why the fragrance brands haven't reached out yet, but like if you are a fragrance brand, my email is in the description box send some pr but anyway i'm definitely dying to get my hands on it i definitely have been hearing mixed reviews if you are going to try out any fragrances definitely get them on the sale because if you don't like anything sephora has a return policy you can send it right on back so definitely do want to try out the yum pistachio gelato super excited about that i have one kayali and i absolutely love it so i feel like i might absolutely love this too and just for reference the 3.4 ounce of this fragrance does retail for 130 $38 I believe I wouldn't get the uh 3.4 I feel like I more than likely will get the 1.7 which is obviously cheaper next thing on my list is Armani Beauty My Way now this is not a new fragrance and I feel like they did recently release a different version of My Way like within like the last few months but I just want the original My Way I've been wanting it for some years but 
it hasn't really been like a must have on my list hence why i have yet to purchase it but i feel like this sale would be the perfect time to purchase especially because it is the springtime now it is a very nice floral scent perfect for the spring and the summertime so i would definitely definitely recommend getting it so far it does have a gift set for my way which i think includes the 1.7 ounce and a travel ounce but not a rollable i'm pretty sure it is a spray and it does retail for 86 dollars and i definitely feel like that's a steal in and of itself but with the 20 percent off that i will be getting i more than likely will purchase this because how could i pass that up next on my list is Prada paradox and i do have this fragrance my boyfriend actually bought it for me for my birthday so shout out to you babe i definitely do recommend this fragrance like i said it is spring so if you are into nice springy sweet floral scents i feel like this definitely is the scent for you it lasts all day long it is definitely intoxicating i think the one ounce retails for about 96 dollars but with the discount y'all know y'all know y'all know but i definitely do recommend that because she is definitely a fave in my collection next thing that is in my sephora wish list is jador by dior i finally smelled it i know i'm always tardy to the party when it comes to certain things i definitely do feel like that is a very very pretty scent i feel like it's very appropriate for all seasons it is a very warm white floral and i feel like i could do a lot with that the 3.4 ounce of jador does retail for um 160 but y'all know more than likely i will not be getting the full size so there's that and the last fragrance on my wish list is hermes twilly O ginger now i do want to build up my hermes fragrance collection i already do have one of the twillies and i absolutely love it it is definitely definitely a fall scent i got the samples for the ginger and i like her a lot i really do and i feel like hermes is a hit and miss when it comes to certain people certain people don't like those nice warm sexy fragrances but i definitely do i have a very very broad fragrance collection so it's definitely on my list the 1.7 ounce does retail for 120 so you know i might be copping her lastly let's hop into skin care like if you know me then you know your girl has really been into skin care heavy now the first two products that i do recommend highly highly recommend and i will definitely without a doubt be purchasing these during the sale are the tatcha rice wash and the tatcha dewy skin cream top tier unbeatable tatcha is that girl if you want to get your skin right i definitely do recommend tatcha i love it because sometimes my skin gets really really dry so the rice wash is very gentle and then the dewy skin cream just keeps my skin moisturized and really locks it in like no other moisturizer i have ever 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 tried so i definitely love those and i will be re-upping i literally just ran out of the face wash and i just bought a new skin cream but i'm halfway done so we need some more next thing on my list and i feel like i probably 99 percent and positive that I will get this is the super goop glow screen I already wanted to try the regular super goop sunscreen because I hear nothing but great things about it but this one is tinted and I feel like it would just be beautiful in the summertime I'm a little nervous though because like I don't know when it comes to like skin tints and stuff I'd be a little hesitant I really do be a little hesitant, but we're going to try it and test it out. The 1.7 ounce retails for $38 and I more than likely will be getting it in the color Golden Hour. Next on my list is topicals. The girlies have been going crazy over topicals, like crazy. So I really want to know what the hype is about. I feel like it's probably going to be worth the hype. I'm positive that it will probably be worth the hype but i definitely do want to try it for myself so there are a few topicals products that i do want to try i want to try the faded cream because i do have like hyperpigmentation from my eczema on parts of my body like my arms and stuff so just to like get even tone on my arms i do want to try the faded mist for you know intimate areas and also the high roller by topicals for ingrown hairs more than likely i will be purchasing all three products uh, so yeah wish me luck y'all next i do highly 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 recommend getting any peter thomas roth face mask and eye patches whatever your skin issues are they have a mask for it they have some eye patches for it whatever you need they have that tatcha is top tier but 
Peter Thomas Ross, he is also very much top tier. Like, I love his products. I swear by them. Like, those are literally the only masks that I swear by. I use other masks, but his masks right there, like, I love them. They are expensive, so that's why I do use other cheaper masks. Because I'm like, I, I'm not going to use up all my good stuff. But I definitely do recommend if you guys really want some amazing mask check his out i really have been wanting to definitely lock down on a consistent skincare routine and i do want to try a serum so i do want to try the drunk elephant vitamin c day serum now will i get it during the sale i don't know but i do recommend for you guys to get it i heard vitamin c is amazing for skin especially for melanin if you have any hyperpigmentation or any problems they say it is really really good for that so if you are into skincare if you're a skincare junkie like i am i definitely recommend that and it retails for 78 dollars the next two things on my list are by the brand alginus and i've never tried anything by them but if you guys know dj envy his wife gia she has like perfect skin and she did a pot well one of their podcasts she talked about all her skincare products and she named these two products so i I definitely do want to use them so it is the liquid collagen hand cream and the liquid collagen serum collagen is amazing for the skin and the older you get the more you lose collagen y'all know i'm still a gerb i'm only 24 years old so your girl still low-key be looking 13 but you do want to correct those things before they happen and the first signs of aging you can always see in your hands so i definitely do want to try the hand cream i'm probably 99 percent positive that i'm going to get the hand cream the serum I really do want to get it like I said I do want to incorporate serums into my skincare routine and the hand cream is $38 while the serum is 115 so the last two things and they are certainly not least on my list are two Tatcha products I should have talked about these when I talked about the first Tatcha products but I have not tried these yet and I definitely do want to try them so first we have the Tatcha Essence skincare boosting treatment and I'm pretty sure it retails for 110 but I heard essences are amazing on the skin i'm pretty sure the reason why they're like so great is that they help all the products really absorb into the skin and really work like they make the products work like times 10 so i'm definitely interested in seeing how those work so i'm definitely interested in incorporating an essence into my skincare routine and what better brand to try than my favorite brand tatcha and lastly is the tatcha rice foaming enzyme powder now this is an exfoliator and i've been feeling like i do need a better exfoliator in my collection currently i use like this sugar exfoliating scrub from like um a random brand i can't even think of the brand top of mind but they definitely sell it at target it's like that face mask brand that like everybody uses oh tree hut is it tree hut I don't even know if it's Tree Hut. Whatever. I use that to exfoliate when my skin feels a little dull and needs a little exfoliation action. And then I also use the Peter Thomas Roth Pumpkin Enzyme Mask. That is an exfoliator and that is amazing. But I do want another exfoliator in my routine. So I feel like this would be amazing. Since I already use an enzyme exfoliator, I feel like, you know, my skin would adjust to this really, really well. And again, my favorite brand, Tatcha, I feel like they will definitely be coming through for your girl and it retails for $68. All right, besties, so those are all of my recommendations for the upcoming Sephora sale. I hope y'all shop, shop till y'all drop. If you know me, retail therapy is the best therapy. Don't let nobody tell you any different. Don't let anybody tell you any different because I promise you, when I'm feeling sad, anxious and all those things a new package will definitely brighten my day it might be a little toxic but that's just how i live my life but anyway <laughs> um don't forget to like comment and subscribe comment down below what you guys will be picking up during the sephora sale and if you're watching this after the sale comment down below what you got or shoot what you missed out on because there's always going to be another sale make sure you guys follow me on tiktok because i keep you guys updated on sales and things like that on there and yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.